Hey everyone, today we're going to be unboxing and setting up this ASUS USB Bluetooth 4.0 adapter. It's model number USB BT400. I picked this one up off of Amazon. If you are interested, I'll have a link below in the description so you can grab one for yourself. But hey, if you're new here, my name is Ken and this is Northern Viking Every Day. And we bring you videos on reviews and how to's. So please consider subscribing so you don't miss out on any upcoming videos. Let's go ahead and dive right into setting up this ASUS Bluetooth adapter. So let's go ahead and open up this Bluetooth adapter. Again, it's model USB BT400. It's Bluetooth 4.0. It says it's compatible with USB 3.0, 2.1, and 2.0. Full Windows 10 support, a two-year warranty. And it looks like on the back here, it shows you can use it with tablets, printers, speakers, keyboards, mice, and headphones is what they're showing on the back. So let's go ahead and open this right up here. Just slice the seals. There we go. Now let's open this right up. Now I did already look at the instructions quickly online as well. So I kind of know what's going on with this Bluetooth adapter already. Um, there it is right there. I'll give you a closer look in a moment. Um, looks like we've got some instructions. There's some troubleshooting stuff as well as there should be a disc here. Yeah. So if you have a um, CD or DVD drive on your computer, you can use that to install the drivers. I actually pre-downloaded them off their website and we'll go into that in a moment so we don't have to use a disc, which a lot of you might rather do. Um, let's have a look at the dongle itself. Pull it out of there. There it is right there. It says ASUS on it. It's super tiny. I'll give you a close-up right now so you can have a quick look. And yeah. So let's jump over to my computer and install the drivers first, which is what they're recommending before we plug this in. So you can go ahead and use the driver that came with it on the disc, or you can download it off their website. And I'll put a link to this below in the description. And you just select your OS here. So Windows 10 64-bit is what I'm using. I already downloaded this and it's over here on my desktop. Let me just unzip it. So I'm gonna right click on it and extract all. And I'm just gonna unzip it to my desktop. We'll let that do its thing here. And once that's done, let's open that up and we can double click on it. Looks like there's a driver package and an installer package. We'll click on the installer package. And the one here that says application, we'll just double click on that. And that should allow us to install it. Welcome to the device driver installation wizard. Hit finish. Now that I'm done that, we're just gonna plug the Bluetooth adapter into my computer into one of the free USB ports and we'll get this all set up. So once I plugged that into my computer, a Bluetooth icon showed up right here in the bottom right in my system tray. It's really small. If you double click on that, it should take you right to the Bluetooth and other devices settings page. Now, if you didn't see that Bluetooth icon in the bottom right, you can also get to this page by searching for Bluetooth here in your search bar in the bottom left. So if I just start typing Bluetooth down here, you should see an option that says Bluetooth and other device settings. If I left click on that, it'll take us right to the same page. Now the first thing we need to do is make sure our Bluetooth is turned on. You can see mine is turned on right there. There's a toggle switch that's off and that's back on. Make sure that is turned on. We're gonna go ahead and add a Bluetooth device right now. So I've got this Bluetooth mouse that we're gonna be connecting today. This other mouse I'm using is not connected with Bluetooth. So we're gonna make this one connect via Bluetooth. And in order to do that, we wanna make sure we just click this plus sign up here right next to where it says add Bluetooth or other devices. Go ahead and left click on that. And a window is going to pop up that looks something like this. And there's a few different options here. The first one says Bluetooth, mice, keyboards, pens, and other kinds of Bluetooth devices. There's wireless displays and docks, as well as there's everything else, Xbox controllers, wireless adapters, etc. We want to click on this first one here that says Bluetooth, mice, and keyboards. Just click on that. And it's going to start searching for our device. Now we want to make sure our device is discoverable. And mine has a connect button on it. So I'm just going to hold that down and the button should start flashing on the front, or the light, I should say, and it should pick up this Bluetooth mouse there. It just showed up. Now, each Bluetooth device is different, how you get it into pairing mode. My headphones, you have to hold down the power button for about five seconds. So um, you'll have to double check with your device how to get it into pairing mode. When you see your device here, you can go ahead and left click on it, and it's gonna start connecting that, and you can see it's setting it up here. And let me see if this is already working if I put this down there. You bet, it's already working. And it's really that simple to connect the Bluetooth device and set up your ASUS Bluetooth adapter. 
So hope you enjoyed this unboxing and setup of the ASUS USB Bluetooth 4.0 adapter model number USB BT400. If you did, make sure to give this video a thumbs up. Also, if you're interested, I have created a similar video on the TP-Link version of Bluetooth adapter. You can check that out. I'll have it linked below in the description. Thank you so much for watching today. Remember to subscribe here on YouTube and until next time, take care.